Tell us, hey, that's my nigga. I made him a me and that fuck. What's good, YouTube? It's your girl in a coat back with another video. And I hope you guys are feeling good, feeling blessed, and all that great mess. And I just want to say thank you guys for getting me to 2K. Man, that was a long run. I didn't think we was going to make it for my birthday, but we did. My birthday's actually next week. I want to say thank you for the early birthday gift. But if you guys want to give me a little some some a little, little dollar or something, just, you know, cash at me. It's going to be in the description below. And um, I just want to thank the few people who have already cashed at me i love you guys and uh we are on the next series of fire in the booth a call of fire in the booth part one we did mike righteous that was serious fire so i'm gonna finish bugsy malone probably after i finish akala so part one let's go so you gonna dig this oh uh, yeah perfect yo 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 oh shit yo I like you. You're like a tiger. Yes, I grew up on a door in a single parent family. Been through a little bit of tragedy. Yes, I was around drugs and violence before the day that I started secondary. That's part of it, not half of it. Get the picture, the rest ain't necessary. Growing up, got a little caught up. That ain't even half of my life. Also, given the knowledge of self, that is all we actually need to survive. If you saw me, age nine, reading Malcolm, just fine. Teachers still treated me stupid. Students that couldn't speak English, they put me in groups with. The irony is, some of the first man to give me schooling, you were called Jacksons. Okay, 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 okay. I feel like he he rapping about his life. Well, he freestyling about his life, his childhood. I'm trying to catch everything, but you know, he going for it. Even half of my life, also given the knowledge of self, that is all we actually need to survive. If you saw me, age nine, reading Malcolm, just fine. Teachers still treated me stupid. Students that couldn't speak English, they put me in groups with. The irony is, some of the first man to give me schooling, you were called gangsters. I already explained that we know what the truth is. They used to say, don't be like me. Yeah, I got a name and dope on the street. Nighttime comes, I can't sleep. It's the part that rappers don't speak. We don't hit the boat because we're tugs. Don't come out the room, want to sell drugs. If we got the right guidance and love, would we fight people just like us? How can I knock the hustle? to get by how do you think i ate as a child judge no one done many things wrong just don't boast about it in songs but listen to my older bars i was just as confused as you probably are but you go when you learn Travel on. hey one too many man you know get caught one too many man that could have been doctors end up spending the whole life boxed up you learn if you study so set out just to make them money no cover it's all about getting poor people to fight with one another so it's not you that us killing our brothers this and our mothers is right in line with the dominant philosophy of our time but time is a Wait. cycle not a line hold up my bad my bad we got one is bad one time many men that could have been doctors end up spending the whole life boxed up you learn if you study so set out just to make them money no cover it's all about getting poor people to fight with one another so it's not okay. that us killing our brothers this and our mothers is right in line with the dominant philosophy of our time hey. time is a cycle not a line coming back around you regain your mind you be ready for the energy i challenge in my mind remedy the pedigree the jeopardy in your mind when the world is left it is a crime we can all fight where the brothers over crumbs harder to fight the one who makes guns we can all talk sh get two dollars harder to be the one who seeks knowledge if we understood economics with no money it's nothing Going out shopping, giving up the culture for everyone's profit. Who runs Bollywood? Indian people. Who runs our dish? So we shake our ass and dance as if racism just up to vanish. But has it? No, it's right on course to be and so by the drink to exist. Wait, wait! I feel like you. Oh, come on. Let's run this. Wow. It definitely costs more than your chain and businesses and property. Far from starving, they eat quite properly. And I don't care. You said it for the kids. You need to know you're not broke to listen. Don't know what asset from a liability. They've never been shown nor told the difference. So they don't change situation. Which is man in Britain is Asian. That's significant. Not coincidence. Asian people build businesses, not by flossing, going out shopping, giving up the culture for everyone's profit. Who runs Bollywood? Indian people. Who runs our dish? So we shake our ass and dance as if racism just up to vanish. But has it? No. It's right on course to be and so by the drink to no, let me not just make sweeping statements. Give me a second, I'll explain it. There's more amounts of drug possession, there's more black people in jail in America. The net is for rape and armed robbery and murder all put together. You can say they're just knocking up tugs. Imagine they're in prison every middle class kid that had ever held drugs. 
Oh, that's right, that'll be your kids. Bigger than that, what is going on with this? Prison in America's private business. They get paid 50k per year per inmate by the state. Just wait. Also, legally, are allowed to use their prison inmates as slaves. Cheap state labor. Big corporations, they come out of jail when they can't get a job. So when we celebrate going to jail, we electorally celebrating enslavement. Add to that, that's the hood that you live in. Engineered social condition that breeds crime by design. Yes. You think you get your money and you can say that they're just black. What I like to deal with facts. In the 1920s, you would have found in America black towns, prosperous centers of economics. To Yo, he's speaking truth right here, though. Come on, though. Burn those towns to the ground, killing hundreds if it ain't understood. You think you were always living in the hood? It's only been 60 years since the Hungax and Burnham, and that was so cool. They were your plastic picnic baskets, even gave kids the day off school. Go see a lynching, have a picnic, it's fun to watch the little monkeys die. And people act a little dysfunctional. You wanna pretend that you don't know why? If your color means you can be killed and you're powerless to get justice about it, is it difficult to figure about how you would end up feeling about it? And that ain't excuses. Just what the? Of what the? Come on, man. Come on, man. The Hungax and Burnham, and that was so cool. <sighs> Makes the education to make you proud. But some people couldn't bear that the former slaves would not just lie down to the KKK and other hate groups. Burn those towns to the ground, killing hundreds if it ain't understood. You think you were always living in the hood? It's only been 60 years since the Hungax and Burnham, and that was so cool. They were your plastic picnic baskets, even gave kids the day off school. Go see a lynching, have a picnic, it's fun to watch the little monkeys die. And people act a little dysfunctional. You wanna pretend that you don't know why? If your color means you can be killed and you're powerless to get justice about it, is it difficult to figure out how you would then end up feeling about it? And that ain't excuses, just dealing with the roots of abuses that make a reality. What a generation of young men speak of ourselves as dirt, casually. That's America. This Britain, something similar, some different In this country, the first enslaved were the working class What's changed? Worst job, worst conditions Most tax, look where you live and yet you go to the pub Friday night, you will fight with a guy Don't know what for, won't fight with a guy Shoot in a tight, you send your kids to die in a war They don't send the kids to the rich or the politician It's your kids, the poor British But they send to go and die in a foreign land For these wars that you don't understand Yeah, they say you are What? What? Patriotism, the fear, but in reality you have more in common with immigrants Than with your leaders, I know Both sides of my family, Bruh. black and white, offended mentality reality in this system poor people dirt regardless of shape but with that said let's not pretend that everything is the same when our grandparents came here to britain if you had a criminal record you couldn't get in that ain't protected for all of the stupid stupid abuses they would be living kicked in the teeth stabbed in the street many times firebombed our houses put feces through our letterbox and of course the cops did so much about it daily up to the i eight, can't eight, eight, right now because i was a baby but of course that's had no effect on why today we are crazy and none of this was for any good reason they were just dark and grieving to ease the guilt now for all of this treatment, constant stereo tax and needed. So if I celebrate how big that I'm hitting off, bricks that I'm flipping, clips that I'm sticking, chicks that I'm hitting, I'm playing my position. But if I teach a kid to be a mathematician, messing with the schism, how they gonna fill a prison when materialism is no longer our religion? What do you think we got now in Britain? Just like America, private prison, prison for profit. That mean when your kids go to jail, people make money off it. So keep environments that breed crime, build more jails at the same time. No right, right. As long as rich kids ain't dying, it's fine. Get them to the point where some are so lost that you believe if they don't celebrate killing themselves. Soft. But it's because their soft was Malcolm soft was Marley soft. Tell me, was Marcus Garvey soft? Right? Was Muhammad Ali soft? Nah, nah, I think not. But they want us to think that the bold is cool. Being on bold is all we can do. We don't control the wholesale productions. Who benefits from us moving the food? All thinking there's no way out of old life. But Malcolm X used to hustle on the roadside. And Marcus Garvey organized more than six million people with no Facebook or Twitter. Why is it something you can't eat? Ish. One of my oh, Hey! Hey! Today I want my car, yeah, is it now more important what I've got to say? But when I drive a Mercedes, by the way, so everybody listen to what I've got to say. Huh. Does that make you all happy? Ah, oh, but she, is your head still nappy? Think for myself, since I'm mad at me. But on the mic, it, not one bad as me. All of this here is good for the rhyme. Put us in the same place at the same time, and it's clear to everybody I'm out of my mind. Some of these guys are running out, and it rhymes clear to everybody. Those got ears, I'm the guy that they just might fear that they want to get near, but they can't have a peer all day. I'm hard to you just like beer. Front on the kids for another five years. Come to my shows with some criteria. Mean that much to them. It's a movement. I don't speak for myself, but a unit, black, 
white man, woman, anyone who respects truth, we put in. Dudes are like no villain, we're just putting. Yeah, you're sweeping on something, pudding. You can never ever be with a level on. All songs get played out there in Lebanon. We speak for the people properly, not for the old fat guys in offices and the girls laughing. Ain't fair, you can't even be bothered to comb this hair. Anyway, that's enough kissing my own ass. Back to the more important task of being so shower. I've got half the hood screaming, knowledge is power. And I ain't saying that'll change that, that. But I do know this for a fact. Right now, there's a you on your block with his hands on his hood. Straight screwed up, so he don't care, don't give up. That he won't let nobody call his block, but the words go in. Open your shack covers once that's happened, there is no going back. Or would you stop to see what is really happening? Who the enemy you should be attacking is. So read, read, read. Stop on the block, read, read. Sitting in the box, read, read. Don't let them say what you can achieve. Because when people are enslaved, one of the first things they do is stop them reading. Because it is well understood that intelligent people will take their freedom. Because if we knew our power, we would understand we can't be held down if we knew our power. We would not elevate not one of these clowns if we knew our power. We wouldn't get arrogant when we get two pennies if we knew our power. We would see what everybody sees that we're rich. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, man. What the fuck? Yo, and he just nah, stop the seven minutes. Hold up. So he don't care, don't give up That he won't let nobody call his block But the words go in Open your shack covers Once that's happened, there is no going back Would you stop to see what is really happening? Who the enemy you should be attacking is So read, read, read Stuck on the block, read, read Sitting in the box, read, read Don't let them say what you can achieve Because when people are enslaved One of the first things they do is stop them reading Because it is well understood That intelligent people will take their freedom Because if we knew our power We would understand we can't be held down If we knew our power If you knew your power One of these clowns if we knew our power We wouldn't get arrogant when we get two pennies if we knew our power We would see what everybody sees that we're rich already Whenever my NMCs go run for your mummy I'm hungry, I run for my time I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry Yo, that whole flow right there Box, read, read, don't let them say what you can achieve Cause when people are enslaved One of the first things they do is stop them reading Cause it is well understood that intelligent people Will take their freedom Cause if we knew our power We would understand we can't be helped Intelligent people will take your freedom <sighs> Our power, we would not elevate not one of these clowns if we knew our power. We wouldn't get arrogant when we get two pennies if we knew our power. We would see what everybody sees that we're rich already. Whenever my NMCs go run for your mummy, I'm hungry, I run for my tummy. That's enough. Back to worshiping money. I'm off. Back to the study. Man! No! That was a whole message. Yo. Look, at the beginning, I did not know where he was going to go. But I was like, got into it. Oh my God, he just blew my freaking mind. Oh my God, he blew my freaking mind. Yes. Yo. Akala. Can't wait for part two. Jesus. Alright. You guys are feeling the color fire the booth part one. Please give this video a thumbs up as well. Comment down below. Like actually like comment share this video, man. Jesus. Whew. That kind of shook me. The whole message, yo. It's a whole message. But if you guys are new to the game, please hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification. Stay tuned for fire in the booth sessions, man. It's about to be a whole series. We already took care of Mike Righteous. We still on Mike Righteous, but we right now we on a collar fire, fire in the booth. We going, oh my God, yo. I can't believe that, Jimmy, right there. Oh my God, I can't believe that. I cannot believe that right there. <sighs> UK has some of the most underrated rappers out here. Man, I'm sorry. If I could put y'all like on on a US radio, I would. I would. I would go call, but like, hey man, I need you to pay play a collar, y'all. Like, come on, throw some Mike Righteous up there. All right.
you guys hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned for this series right now. You know what I'm saying? But until then, you guys stay safe. Stay humble. Stay brazy.